Amen. Reading from the Gospel of Mark, Jesus went up the mountain and summoned those for whom he wanted, and they came to him. He appointed twelve, whom he also named apostles, that they might be with him, and he might send them forth to preach, to have authority to drive out demons. He appointed to twelve, Simon, whom he named Peter, James, son of Zebedee, John, the brother of James, whom he named Bonages, his son, that is, sons of thunder, Andrew, Philip, Bartholomew, Matthew, Thomas, James, son of Alphaeus, Thaddeus, son of Simon the Canadian, and Judas Iscariot, who betrayed him. There you have the twelve apostles. Can you name the twelve apostles? Uh, <laughs> it's even challenging for me. I had to say that I should know it by heart, but I learned this way to remember the names of the apostles. Think of the word baptism. Can you spell baptism? B-A-P-T-I-S-M. Good. Change the I to a J. B A P T B J instead of S. I mean then S M. So here they are then. Who are the names? B was B Bartholomew. A we have Andrew. P we have Peter. Any other P? So I'm going real quick here. Philip is a, with the beings of the P. P A P T. We have Thaddeus and we have Thomas with the T. J. We have a couple of James. We have Judas. We have John. Those are the J's. S. We have Simon. M. We have, and don't forget, I did say Judas and I, and then uh, J, S, Simon, and M is Matthew. So there you have it. In case you want to show off, and maybe, maybe make a bet. Hey, I bet I can name all the 12 apostles. So think of the word baptism, change the I to a J. Hmm? And then you will be able to hopefully name the 12 apostles. We should have been able to do this when we were in first grade, but hey, better late than never. God bless you.